Okay, we're on the GT3. Uh, I was cruising over to my friend's house yesterday to watch the Super Bowl and uh, this thing popped a code. Let's see if it's still displaying on the dashboard. The service indicator's on. That's just for an oil change. Um, but let's see here. Well, I don't want to start the car right now, but anyways, um, so I've got uh, this iCarsoft OBD2 scanner. Uh, they call it the POR version 2. Um, there may be a new version out um, on Amazon, but uh, this one is what I use for the um, this 997 GT3 and my 991 Turbo, so Turbo S. So um, it's pretty simple. Uh, it's got uh, a main menu here, and uh, what I do is I just go to the diagnostics um, function, and then, let's see, how do I do this? Oh, yeah. Diagnostics, enter, Porsche, version 1. And then I'm in a 997. Then I just do a smart scan. And then you can see it'll say some diagnostics indicators. Thermostat stuck open. P2181, thermostat stuck open, okay. Okay, don't know what that is. So you basically just go through each of these. You know what, I'm just gonna turn on the car. Okay, so let's turn this thing on. So it says check engine, visit workshop. And then plug in my seatbelt. Okay, and service now, which is the oil change interval. Okay, so it's got the check engine and the exclamation point, which means there's a message which is the check engine, or the uh, service change, oil change interval. So I'm gonna go back on this thing. Exit out of diagnostics mode. Go back in. Oops. Go back into smart scan, and it's gonna go ahead and scan. And it will tell me that the system is in diagnostics mode or at least the traction control system is, and it's gonna go through. And show me what's up. So I'm gonna go into the DME. Okay, TP2181, thermostat stuck open. So this thing needs a new thermostat, probably. I don't know if that's worth a, a trip to the actual shop. Um, anyways, I'm going to check out the stability fault instrument cluster comfort C190, okay? I'll have to go look that up. Supplementary impact protection, Let's see what's up there. State current communications PSM control unit. Just not supported. Poor 
Georgia Access System C-121, Communication Rear Control Unit, Comfort. Okay, I have no idea what that is. Okay, so none of this stuff looks very critical. A lot of this stuff is the same code. Automatic transmission. Okay, so there's a bunch of stuff in here that isn't really relevant. Some repeated codes. So basically you just page through the system here and see what it see what it's saying. Like in the past, um, I've gotten like P0420, which is the catalyst, which is the cat. And that just means you have to replace the cat, which is expensive but very simple. Or straight I should say straightforward. Um, so I'm none of this stuff is very None of this stuff is very critical as far as the driving of the car goes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clear all these codes and then see which ones come back. So like I'm pretty sure some of the communications modules issues were because my battery died uh, a couple of weeks ago and I had to re-jump re the car. Um, the thermostat might be real. If that comes back, then I'm going to probably have them uh, replace the thermostat next time I'm in for an oil change and then go from there. But yeah, uh, these, these tools are pretty great. Um, I forgot how much I paid for this, but I think it was a couple hundred bucks. Again, it works for both my 997 and my 991, so it's great for clearing oil change intervals and reading codes and resetting codes and all that stuff. So. Um, I'd recommend these. They're pretty. They're pretty easy to use, uh, and they're very lightweight. They're just. They're basically just a plastic um, controller with a really thick OBD2 cable, and it's just plug and play.